Alright guys, sorry it's kind of dark, uh, it's 8.40 where I live at, so sorry dark, but uh, wanted to show you guys the update for the uh, Hilux or SCX10, but uh, here's my solid aluminum axles, metal diff, locker, sorry for the noise, I got a text, um, I mean this is sweet man. Bought these, they just came in. That's the rear axle. I'm try and zoom in, it's kind of bright now, but I have to have that light on so you guys can see it. Locker, rear end, of course. And here's my aluminum skid plate. So that way I could put this on the Hilux and put the plastic one from the Hilux slash SCX10 on the uh, barrage. Since you guys know I have a 540 motor on that. Because uh, I'm going to throw the stock axles and links on the uh, barrage from the deadbolt. The CX-10. Here's the metal Y-link or aluminum metal Y-link. I'm waiting for the other links for the upper and lowers for the rear. And then for the lowers for the front. It's all, it's all of them just without the Y-link. That's why I had to get the Y-link. So I'm waiting for those to come in. Hopefully they come in tomorrow. Uh, here's a front one with the servo mount on the axle. I got a different servo mount though. That way this is not on there. It mounts on the chassis. Uh, metal links for the steering comes the shoe horn. Or servo horn, my bad. And uh, it's a locker front end axle too. But uh, I mean, wow, these are really nice quality. They're not a name brand. They're not... They're not Vanquish or RC Four Wheel Drive or Integi or Integra or whatever the heck you call it. <clears throat> this is an off brand, but uh, for the price I paid for them, man, they look sharp. I just hope they work good as good as they look. So for all the kind of off brand stuff that I've gotten here and there, have uh, worked really well. So. Uh, this will match the transmission that's in it too. It's the same color as the uh, transmission I have in the truck now that you guys have seen or could see if you follow all my videos on there. Uh, I have it on there if you haven't seen it. Plus I'll do an update with everything on it and show that too as well. So that way you guys get a full effect, if you will, of everything that's on it. Um, yeah, it's, it's pretty cool, guys. I like it. Looks, I think it looks sharp. And uh, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe. Uh, I'm gonna say it on every video, guys. 14 subscribers for the X Max versus Duck Pond. Uh, once again, I started out with 26 subscribers before I put that video, and I'm up to 30, maybe 31 now. So. You know, I need like 10 or 9 more to go. So, as soon as you guys get it up there, get get that 14 in, man. I'm ready to rip it across that duck pond and go for a swim to go get it. Or hopefully it makes it. I'd rather hope it makes it, but I will go swimming for it. Alright, talk to you guys till next time.